Hello again people, just thought I'd make another video today, a lot of people were asking before about my um, theme that I'm using, the Aloon theme, um, not really much to say on it, I'll go over how you get it, and pretty much it's done automatically, um, things it changes, you can see at the bottom here, where normally you'd show more icons, you've got a little dot instead which is cool, it's like a little iPhone type button uh, start button instead of the orb changes to a button which looks different again all the buttons have changed so on folders the back buttons they're now set, well, see through just going with the um ah, forgotten the name now Windows has built it in uh, uh, doesn't matter um, it's changed the design of the windows um, at the top it's got lots of little diagonal lines oh it's arrow the arrow effect <laughs> yeah um, some icons have changed not many of them custom pack tools it does have something built in so when you right click a folder you can set the folder color so I can make that yeah, I can make it blue I can make it red. It's just a way of picking, well, showing where different folders are. Set it to zero, set it to default again. I thought that was a pretty cool part of it. So, what you want to do, custopack.com. Um, I'll put a link in the description. Um, you'll be shown this page. You want to press download and pick any of the download links. It should load up automatically like that has press save you get the executable um, I should have had it downloaded already but oh well that will load up double click it run it there you go you get the install you want to install that just wherever you want won't accept any of this is retarded next change the drive and install so Ah, it's because I've already got it installed. Don't worry about that. Okay. Yeah, I've already got it. Okay, you'll be given this window. You can just press finish and run. So, loading up. There you go. You'll be given this. Now, this is the Custo Pack Tools window. It's quite simple, but... Well, the basic idea is you download themes that are automatically installed. Normally, you'll have to go through all this changing files and re replacing everything. But this does it all automatically and just works a lot easier. Um, for the Alun theme that I'm using now, you'll need to go to Download Custo Packs. And these are all the ones that work with the program. They are updated. I haven't seen many updated. This is just set for Windows 7 at the moment. But there are others. Um, so, for this example, I'll use Alun. So, we go to download. Does this one? Yep. It'll load up. Press save. You'll double click that. Run. You're about to install Alun. Do you want to continue? Yes. That will put it into the program. I don't know if this will work. Yeah, it did. Okay, then when you go back into custom pack tools, you'll see this. It's basically showing screenshots. See here, these are the things I was showing a second ago. Like these turn blue and red. You get the little bars, all of that. Yeah. So, you go back, choose a custom pack. Custom pack's ready to be installed. Click that. And there you get the Elune theme you just downloaded. You go into here. I've already got it installed, but normally it would be an install this pack. And you'd literally, hang on, I'll press repair. Um, yeah, I'll do basic. Hopefully it won't ask me to restart my computer. Normally you would have to restart it. But that would literally... Yep, I don't know if this is going to lag me out. But it will default all your themes, like it's just done. So, screen's now blue. Back to the default Windows 7 theme. Then, 
it will start loading in all the own well its own background like it's just done it will change the login screen which is pretty cool I like it there you go now it's doing the visual styles the visual styles done see that's got the little dot at the bottom start buttons I've just opened everything um, yeah normally you'd have to restart at the end but I won't bother you don't need to that's pretty much it um how yes I want to go yeah um there are other themes you can install how I'll have a look through them uh custom back gallery yeah Ooh, the twilight <laughs> yeah I think this one looks the best out of all of them but there are ones that look I, th I think this one looked good last time I looked yeah they're all minimalistic just simple themes if you're into like not having clutter on the screen I like that one I might install that one later actually but it's all good um the blog's been going well as I said in my last Minecraft video today I don't know what it's from either YouTube videos or things are getting better on it but well, maybe people are viewing it from YouTube hopefully I need some more people on it though um, I will be posting more videos hopefully more often now so that should be good and just as a leaving present I will leave you with Nyanka <laughs>